On the shores of this historic pilgrimage site, prayers are offered every week for Pope Francis. Asking our Creator, our God, you know, to uh, to to bring you here simply and and to have this meeting with indigenous people. The 85-year-old pontiff is experiencing persistent knee pain, seen using a wheelchair as recently as Friday. Now, some wonder if his postponed trips mean his Canada visit is in peril. If there is any chance that the Pope will not come in, then I think there's going to be a lot of disappointment. We've received no indication that he's considering postponing the trip to Canada. The Archbishop of Regina says it's full steam ahead, the trip being planned to accommodate the Pope's mobility needs. In the past, papal visits have drawn hundreds of thousands of people. But this trip may be substantially smaller, with the Pope only spending an hour tops at each event. I'm confident that if it's at all possible for him to come, he will come. It's possible that having cancelled the trip to Africa uh, will boost his chances to, trip to, to travel to Canada at the end of July. This is a very important trip. Um, it is more critical, I think, for Pope Francis' legacy. And to fulfill his commitment to meet residential school survivors on their land this summer. I think that uh, this, this has to be it, this, uh, this visit. I think this visit is going to happen. I'm uh, very optimistic. That's the hope of many survivors and many millions of Roman Catholics counting down the days to the historic visit. Olivia Stefanovic, CBC News, Ottawa.